Jambu, young wizard. I'm pleased you were able to help Queen Tenai. Our people have a history of war, but she is a good spirit. She wants you to help purify the waterhole. That does not surprise me. We must learn how to make a stronger medicine. Go to the library up in the Baobab Crown. Find Kiliman Kopali for the librarian and ask him for the Book of Babalao. This book contains many recipes for strong muti. Read it and tell me what it says to cure fire water. Ah, welcome. You are a wizard from Wizard City. I have been very impressed by your classmates. Your teachers must be proud. You need the book of Baba Lawo. If Inyanga wants it, it must be important. You find it right over there. Be sure to tell Inyanga White Stripes what you learned from the book. Hello, young wizard. Are you? The best way to understand Zafaria is to experience it. There are five masterpieces of ancient. You read through the book and find a cure for fire water recipe that sounds appropriate. It calls for zaphirite gemstones and grains of paradise. Zafirite gemstones and grains of paradise? Hmm. Grains of paradise are peppery seeds from Zamunda. Ask Councillor Unati Nightrunner if she can help us obtain some. Zafirite is a precious gem mined in the foothills near Stone Town. Why don't you ask Veer Goodhart if he knows where to find Zafirite gemstones in Baobab? Once you get both items, return here. You need grains of paradise? That is a small enough favor. You can find a spice merchant in the market, Takozo Trustride. Use my name, and she will give you what you need. Hello! I haven't seen you in a while. Have you had any luck chasing down the missing students? Oh, I see. Yes, I can help you with your plan to restore the water hole. You need zaphirite gemstones? There is a grand gem merchant in the Baobab market, Mawa Jade Tusk. Tell her I said you could have a handful of the finest zaphirite gemstones. Counselor Nightrunner sent you. Of course you can have some grains of paradise. Here, let me get you a sack of the pods.
Veer Goodhart said you can have what? Does he think sapphirite gemstones grow on trees? Fine, you can have them. But someone is going to have to pay for these. I'll put them on the councillor's account. Excellent. These will do perfectly. Your timing is just right. I began the recipe while you were gathering the last ingredients. Go inside my hut and put the grains of paradise and the zaphirite gemstones into the cauldron. Let it come to a boil. Then remove the medicine from the heat and we will have the mighty healing muti. Take this powerful potion and pour it in the water hole. If we have done a good job, and the spirits are kind, it will work. Once you have done this, tell Queen Tanai Ghost Main that the curse is broken. It will not cure all of her people instantly, but it will work over time. You add the grains of paradise. They give the concoction of peppery aroma. Then you add the zaphirite gemstones. They dissolve into a shimmering cloud of crystals. Clearly, this is a strong medicine. Powerful antidote has restored this poisoned pool back to a life-giving oasis. You have given us a new day. I will tell you how to open the Savo door, which leads inside Nemean Rock. But you must promise to break King Monster's curse. Thank you. Find the hermit Aesop Thornpaw, who lives on the edge of the Yundland Gulch. He knows many secret things. Ask him how to break the curse. The bridge across the gulch has been broken, so you will have to find some wood to fix it. Hello there. Don't see many tourists around here. Can I offer you a cold drink? Hey, you fixed my bridge. That's terrific. Quinton, I sent you. Yeah, it's a terrible crime what happened to them. Bad juju. I might know a spell that can break the curse Nurgle and his witch laid on King Manta. However, those scuffy fire lions stole my drums before they smashed my bridge. If you can get them back, I'll teach you the juju.
track down those mangy fire lion ravagers and kick their tail. Get my drums back and I'll teach you an impressive solo. May the ancestors let you abide. With my drums back, I can compose an epic song to praise your ability. Try not to lose against Nurgle, the burn lion. Here, take this Jimby drum with you. Let me teach you a secret beat. With it, you can call to King Mansa and help him find his way back to his own skin. Now go tell Queen Tanai Ghostmane what I said. Amazing! You are a chief among wizards! The Griot Aesop gave you a magic drum? Good! Now I will tell you the ancestral prayer you need to open the Savo door. Awimowa, Awimowa. Enter the Savo door, defeat the evil Nego, and free King Mansa! Once King Monster is free, can you tell Captain Becky Blackhoof that our people want peace again? Kings of old called to the sun for help, and the warriors of light came from across the spiral. You 
enter the cave at the foot of Nemean Rock. Someone is trapped in a spider web. You should free her. I was afraid I was going to become their snack. You must be looking for the other students. The fire lions herded us here, into an ambush with the Umbra Queen. She ordered them to capture all the students. I caused a diversion so most of the students could get away, but they caught Joanna Groflyer. I think Nurgle has her. Please, you have to save her. My pets were gifts from the great Umbra Queen. She gave them to me in exchange for Mansa's golden crown. But you are just more meat. I'll roast you up and gobble you down. Then I'll eat this other calf for dessert. Ha! My shadow fire will dispel your petty magics and make you weak.
fiercest fighter I have ever known. I have never suffered such a great beating. I am undone. Wow, I can't stop shivering. This adventure turned out to be a bad idea. I'm going home right now. Praise you and your ancestors, mighty wizard. You defeated my brother and cured our sick waterhole. You are truly a king. Sadly, Nurgle's witch, the Umbra Queen, stole our golden crown, the symbol of the lion's power. No good will come of this. My people will come to their senses as they drink from the clean water. I will call them in and restore order to the tribes. Please tell Captain Becky Blackhoof that peaceful times will come between the lions and the zebras again. What's that? You have restored order to the lion tribes? Amazing! Thank you for bringing me this news and for carrying King Mansa's message of peace. What are you worried about? You found Masizi. That's great news! Come, let us talk inside my hut. Welcome to my home. Please share this cola nut with me. Masizi has returned to us. Thank you for freeing her. Speak to her to learn her story. Then we will discuss your plans. When we were attacked by the Umbra Queen and her creatures, most of the students fled. They would have run towards the Munda, where my people dwell. There is no easy way to get there from here, however. It is as I thought. You must follow your herd to Zamunda. With luck you'll catch them there. Go back to Baobab first, that is the easiest road. Take this order and give it to the Ikla warrior, Idube Fire Dancer, at the jungle gate in Baobab. He will let you pass. Once you reach Zamunda, show the order to Captain Sizani Sunrunner. She will help you. Come visit me in the market, and I will make you a real bargain. Mm. 
this gate is closed to outsiders. What is that? You have an order from Captain Blackhoof? Hmm. All right, then. You can pass. Safe travels. Where did you come from? Who did you say you were again? No matter. If Captain Blackhoof vouches for you, you're well striped in my book. Can you help us out? My forces are stretched thin trying to hold back these big noses. A wagon carrying provisions was just attacked by a pack of jackals. Those curs love to strike when chaos is raining down. Hunt down the jackal bandits and recover our provisions. Look for clues at the wagon. wagon was attacked by a cowardly ambush. A trail leads off into the jungle with Jackal Prince alongside. The trail leads that way.
You find the sacks of provisions the jackals took from the wagons. Now to return them to Captain Sunrunner. was quick. I need you again, young wizard. These blasted big noses captured one of our guard towers. If we don't retake it, we'll lose major ground. Help us out. Defeat the Greyhorn mercenaries and free the Igoka prisoners. Well done! You thrashed those big-nosed brutes. You have helped us secure things out here. At last, we can breathe a little easier. Come, I will have them open the Zorse gates, and we can talk inside.
Welcome to Zamunda. I thought we would have a moment to talk, but one of the guards just told me the big Norse stole many of our shields. Please defeat some of the Greyhorn mercenaries and reclaim our shields. Once you've collected them, put them in the armory. You're an excellent warrior. Now that you have recovered our shields, it is time to muster the warriors in the city. Tell them to go to the barracks, arm them, and help train them to fight the big noses by showing them how to duel. Now it's time to head over to the barracks and get these troops some weapons. Time to show them how to fight like warriors.
have taught us so much, Great Wizard. I will remember these lessons for a long time. I'm sure you gave them a proper lesson in the fighting arts. Your help has proven invaluable. Captain Blackhoof's order said you were looking for a missing herd of wizards? I think you should speak to our king, Shaka Zibu. You will find his magician, Tsitsi Snaketail, near the palace. Plead your case with Tsitsi, and I'm sure he will help you. Greetings, wizard. You look as though you are lost. Tell me what you seek, and I will help you find what you need. You are searching for a missing herd of wizard students? I have heard rumors of these tourists to our land. King Shark Azibo wants to meet you immediately, but he is in the middle of a war council. We must wait until he is free. I have heard legends of the greatness of you wizards. It would inspire our warriors to know you fought with them. Show us that the Long Dreamer Shamans and Greyhorn mercenaries are no match for your strong medicine. <laughs> this will impress Shaka Zibu.
Impressive. I did not think you would win. So quickly. <laughs> Shaka Zibu heard how you beat the Long Dreamer shamans like a drum. He wants you to raise a force of Igoka defenders and strike the elephants like summer lightning in heavy thunder. Go to the barracks and rally the Igoka defenders. I'll meet you there. This doesn't look right at all. You got here too fast. I mean, I am Tom Tom Snakeskin, a Greyhound. I mean, we are a Goka defender. I mean, Barbara, kill the wizard!
didn't go very well. Thank you for freeing us. They got the drop on us. I thought they were on our side. Hurry and tell Captain Cizani what happened here. Warn her that the king's magician, Tsitsi Snaketail, is actually a Greyhorn. What? Titi Snaketail is a Greyhorn? Oh, Titi is not a Greyhorn, but a traitor disguised as one. And he had Greyhorn mercenaries painted up as zebras? In we must tell Shaka Zebu once we have hard proof. The Greyhorns didn't get in through the Zos Gate, so there must be a breach. Search the city walls to find the breach and please fix it. Once you've reinforced it, meet me back outside the Zos Gate. There it is. A hole big enough for a Greyhorn to pass through. You'll need to find some wood planks to fix it. Much better. No Greyhorn will sneak through there again. You found and fixed the hole in the wall? Good work. I have not found the evidence we need yet, but I had to check on the Agoka defenders out here. It's not going well. The Greyhorns have put a scout tower on fire. Defeat some Greyhorn mercenaries and survey the scout tower. Then report back.
tower is burning. But look, down there by the riverbank, water elementals. It looks as if the Long Dreamer shamans have the water elementals under their control. Water elementals? That gives me an idea. If you could get control of the water elementals, we could use them to douse the fire. You'll need to defeat the Long Dreamer shamans and claim their stone talismans. They use those to control the elementals. Did you get the stone talismans? Very good. Now that you have the stone talismans, you can compel the water elementals into helping us. Of course, they are chaotic spirits, so you'll have to show them how strong your medicine is. Defeat the water elementals to let them know you are in charge, then use them to put the fire out. Here's a bucket.
You've shown the water elementals who's boss. After you beat them, they hop into your bucket. Using the bucket, you direct the water elementals at the fire. With a hiss and a billow of smoke, the fire goes out. I can see the cloud of smoke from here. Great job. Now, let's find that traitor. My scouts scoured the area, but haven't found anything useful. Can you check the magician's hut near the palace for clues? I'll wait back inside the city gates to hear what you found. Tsitsi's hut is locked up and dark. But what's this? Outside, you find jars of white and black paint. You should bring them to Captain Sunrunner as proof. These jars of paint are the evidence we need. Tsitsi used them to camouflage the Greyhorns with white and black stripes. I'm sure this paint is enough proof for Shaka Zibu. We'll tell him how Tsitsi used it to disguise the Greyhorns in his attempt to replace the Igoga defenders with his own men. But the palace is still locked. I know. Take this evidence to Queen Amale Adamre. I'm sure she will help you. You can find the Queen in the Moon Gardens. Here's a key to the gate. Hello, wizard! As you can see, one of the key treasures of Zamunda is this star obelisk. It lends the moon gardens a sense of the sublime. I have studied the obelisk for many months and recently had a breakthrough, but the long dreamer shaman stole my star rituals. I cannot translate the meaning of the star obelisk without them. Can you get them back for me? You'll find the long dreamer shamans in the Zamunda outskirts. Once you retrieve them, I'll teach you how to read the Star Obelisk. Hello, young wizard. We need your help. I have heard of you, young wizard. I hope we can help each other. Tell me your story. The king's magician, Tsitsi Snaketail, said he was also looking for a herd of wizards, for nefarious purposes, no doubt. Tsitsi has somehow broken the spirit of the great Shaka Zibu. Here, use this key to enter the palace. You'll find Shaka in the king's court. Perhaps your magic can cure him. You feel a sinister presence in here. The air is stuffy and cloying. You think it's coming from the sickly baobab tree. The king's eyes reveal that he is under a dark spell. You sense a dire link to this corrupted baobab tree, which looks like it is being strangled by that vine. Yes, 
Our king is under an evil shadow. News of Shaka Zibu's condition has blown to the city like a foul wind. Some of the younger hot-headed stallions are using it as an excuse to riot. They threaten to tear the city down from inside. I need you to show them how foolish they are and how little they know. It is a time to stand strong, not run wild. Please defeat the rioting Impi Raiders so that we have time to find a way to heal Shaka Zibu. You reined them in. Well done. While you were dealing with the upstart Impi Raiders, my daughter Mandisa was keeping an eye out for Tsitsi. She has found the magician. Quick, go and talk to Princess Mandisa Autumn Rain and find out what she saw. Then track Tsitsi down and bring him here. You did an excellent job with those upstart Impi Raiders. I have heard two rival lieutenants are now refusing to work together. This kind of internal strife is intolerable. We need both tribes to work together. Can you talk to Juma Fast Truck and Laduma Thunderhoof and resolve their issues so they will follow orders?